Well, I don't have a crystal ball, unfortunately. I, I can't predict the future. Uh, but I am interested in these three scenarios, heaven, hell, and prevail, that describe three really different ways that 2025 might turn out. And the thing about the heaven and the hell scenarios is that if you were going to ima imagine them as summer blockbuster movies, they wouldn't have much of a plot. You know, it would be the world's changing amazingly. There's nothing much you can do about it. Hang on tight. The end with incredible special effects, but not much of a plot. So I'm not predicting that the prevail scenario will be the one that happens, but it's the one I'm kind of rooting for. And that's the one that I would hope that the students of 2025 have mastered which is figuring out how to change the world as individuals, in, as in groups, in networks, in a bottom-up way, taking control of their futures, taking control of our lives, and not waiting around for the authority figures to do it. Don't wait for the president. Don't wait for the Senate. Do it yourself.